Okay guys, so it is day one of Violet and uh, also Cloud Buffs. So I actually just got knocked out of Elite Smash by a Violet, um, but I just got back in after fighting another Violet. So let's see what we can do. Hopefully we run into some of them and uh, play with the Cloud Buffs. Whoa. I feel like the Violet on online is a fucking threat, man, because there's so much shit that you just can't react to because of fucking input, right? That offline you'd be just fine against, like that down B, or even the, the side Bs and shit, but it's like online it's a problem. The shield pressure, dude, that's, shield damage is nuts. Yeah, if a bottom player is good at making reads, terrifying. Alright, so so this is a replay uh, that I just wanted to throw in here because it's fucking disgusting and this is kind of what made me realize how threatening Violet can actually be. Look at this shit. Disgusting. What? Crazy. That was a good ass play from that guy though, so. Props to him, and uh, I'm grateful that now I understand how threatening Violet can be if you're on top, uh, above them, you know? Uh, very, very threatening, so just be careful of shit like that, guys. Oh, no Violet. It's okay, we can still get some footage of some cloud buffs. Okay. That's good damage, though. Yeah. I think the best buffs uh, for Cloud this patch were Up Smash and the Recovery. The Recovery is actually, like, way better. When you sweet spot it, it practically snaps now, and that's actually huge. Instead of the dash attack buffs, I actually would have preferred, like, seeing F-Tilt or uh, Back Air get a little bit more kill power or Limit Cross. Just because those are, like, kind of safer and more go-to kill options. But, you know, the up smash one is really good, though. It's actually a lot faster. Okay, I threw out Limit Cross there, but... Yeah, there we go. Nice and clean. Okay, I want to find some Violets, so no rematch. Yes, a violet. Okay, cool. Let's see how this goes. So I'm gonna, uh, like, as we come into this game, I'm gonna talk about the experiences I have had so far against her. And I find that, one, you cannot be above her, because that up leads to so much shit. And I died on the top at, like, I think I started getting hit around, like, what, 15 or some shit? Uh... And that shit actually killed me, so you cannot be above Violet. And that fucking down B is actually like unreactable online. Like, it's so silly that uh, the amount of times I've gotten hit by that shit. What? That beat out? That's crazy. Is that armored? Someone tell me. I actually think this character is fucking terrifying online. Oh my god! That's not what I was trying to do. What? Okay.
Okay. She can do so much to shields too, so it's like it's crazy. Okay, I went right into that. I'm out of limit. Oh fuck! Dude, I'm telling you, I keep falling for that shit online. Oh my god. And Cause I also don't know when the armor actually starts. Damage here. A little more damage to the point where everything anything should kill. There we go. Nice! That was good. Good catch. Yeah. Oh, I, I might have been able to DI that. I gave that one up. They're actually more scarce on here than I thought for a day. Like two? Or day one or whatever? Okay. I think that will do it. Yeah. Okay, so I've kind of talked about my opinion on Violet as a threatening character online. Uh, and a very threatening character if you are really good with reads, right? A lot of shit that damages the, sh the hell out of shields. And just uh, a lot of crazy stuff in general. Very hard hitting stuff. Oh fuck, I thought I had a jump. That is unfortunate. I'm going to talk a little bit more about the cloud buffs now. Can't do anything about that. Can't just test that right now. Oh, I'll take that. Um, overall, I think the buffs for cloud are okay. The recovery one and up smash one are good. Limit, I, uh, it doesn't feel that much faster to me, but a lot of people are saying that they, they think it's a lot faster, so... I'm gonna wait until like you know beefy smash tweets or some someone explains exactly just how much faster it is. Uh, the side smash one, I think, is I never really had issues with people falling out of F smash. I have I have way more issues with people falling out of cross slash. So I would have taken a cross a cross slash reliability buff over the F smash one. But you know it is what it is. Maybe a future patch. Honestly, I'm surprised they buffed him. Okay, laggy. Yep. But, you know, I think the buffs are enough to move him a few spots higher in his tier. So, from, like, you know, low tier to maybe high low tier, or, like, even mid tier. But I still think his weaknesses are too big to put him in high. Like his frame data is not good. Uh, his kill options are still really limited. Uh, but yeah, I would say maybe mid tier now. Uh, I think we will end the video there, guys. But because I think I've said my thoughts on you know, probably looking cloud buffs. So thank you guys for watching. 
If you guys enjoyed, do remember to subscribe and leave a like, comments or something. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next one.